thanked him for what he did for you. And now you're 50 years old. You ain't never thanked him for nothing. He saved your life so many times. He's healed you so many times. Where's his thanks at? Let praise and worship continue to be on your lips. Like thankfulness. See, people get thankful at Thanksgiving time. Of course, everybody is thanking God. But how about if we thank him every day? We show appreciation every day. We we telling him we, we're grateful. Thank you for the food that I do have, God. Thank you for the clothes I do have, God. I am truly grateful. He said be content with what you have. And if you a good steward over little, glory to your name, Father, that he will give you more. He, he trusts you with more. So if you're not good, I use this as a demonstration. You got a car. It ain't what you want. It ain't the latest. It ain't it ain't all of that. And you you got it trashed out. You got trash in there everywhere. You don't keep it clean. You don't go get it washed. It ain't been washed in years. It ain't been cleaned out in years. All you do is hop in it and go where you want to go and come out. And you asking God for a business. You don't get the car fixed. You ain't never got an oil change. You ain't never got a tune-up. And you keep asking God. Look, this is what God told me. You keep at You want a Benz? And you can't even take up care of the car you got? Glory to your name. I hope I'm helping somebody. You ain't taking care of the car you already got. How can you take care of Benz? Because if a Benz break down, that's some money. You most definitely got to keep that Benz up. You most definitely got to get the oil changes and the tune-up. Because if it break down, you might as well get another car. Because it's, it's going to be more than the car. Just as much. So if you can't keep that car you got already clean, you won't clean it. You won't keep it up. You won't give it a tune-up. You won't give it an oil change. That's important. Oil changes and tune-ups. Those are the main two things you should be taking care of. Stop asking for something else. Because God can't even trust you with that. That's what God taught me. Take care of, be content, and take up care of the little that you already have. And I'll bless you with more. But a lot of us is not doing that. And you're wondering why you're not receiving nothing else. You're wondering why you still got that car. And you're watching everybody else get it. Why, Lord? And then here we come with the complaining. Take care of what you already have. You got a husband. Are you taking care of your husband? Are you loving him? I want a new one. This one broke. This one don't do nothing. This one. Are you are you taking care of him? See, in my in my marriages, my first one was worldly, so of course I didn't do right. Which I still did right, but I had a mouth. And, I, and you don't tell me what to do with all that. So I get that one. But my second one, I said, uh-uh. I'm going to plant good seeds. And if it work, it work. If it don't, it don't. I planted good. Do you hear me? This man did all kind of stuff. And I still planted good. I ran to God every time he did something. I ran to God. Guess what happened? He ended up leaving. I and, 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 and it was so, I loved him so good. He even shouted, why do you love me? That's all I got, sir. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I worked hard to plant good in my marriage. Because I'm like, one day, I'm going to get that husband that's going to treat me and see me for me. Not as a meal ticket. Not as a stealing her blessings. Because, see, the woman has the favor. Did y'all know that? The Bible says the man receives favor. Uh, when a man finds a wife, he receives favor from the Lord. So women is favor. Why do you think men going around sleeping with everybody? They're taking our favor. And that's why they're blessed. A, 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 a woman, a God, can make a poor man rich. A wife. Let's change that. Because he said a man that finds a wife. A wife makes a man rich. 
a man could be doing okay, but when he get